Welcome to the next system test with my Firelight MS-9200 UDLS addressable fire alarm control panel and my Wheelock SPMNS voice evacuation system. Today we're going to be testing the duct detector with the key switch. We're going to test that pole station, the Cerberus Powertronics MS-151, and then we're also going to test the general emergency pole station that I have installed. There are two changes with the notification appliances since the last system test, and the first one being there's now a Wheelock CH70. This is a white fire alarm chime strobe, and I have it set on single stroke, just like the bell, so both of them will be dinging at the same time. This is kind of the older version chime, and this is the newer version chime, and they're both going to be going off at the same time. I think it kind of sounds cool. There is one more change to the notification appliances. This is a voice evacuation system, so I figured everyone would want to see the voice evacuation system in action, or I guess hear it in action. So I've added a device, something I've never done before. This would never be up to code in a building, but as you can see up here, I do have a speaker. And the speaker is just wired into the voice evacuation system, so in addition to those alarms, this will also be going off and playing the female voice evacuation message for fire and emergency. So this right here is a duct detector. It basically looks for smoke in an air duct. And since it's sometimes mounted in hard to reach places, there's an option to usually have a key switch attached to it where you can test it remotely. So we're going to go ahead and do that today for this system test since I haven't done it in a while. You just stick the key in and turn it to test. It'll take a second. Alright, the panel's back in normal condition. Let's go ahead and activate my conventional pull station that I have on the system. Here we go. Alarm! Okay, the system has been silenced, and I think we're going to leave it in alarm mode while we test the emergency, the general emergency pull station. So I have this wired into the green Gentex Commander Horn Strobe, and since everything on the system is chime, I thought I'd go ahead and set the tone on this alarm to chime as well. So you'll get to hear that, and let's go ahead and test it. I think for today's test, I don't know when the last time was I did this, if ever will key activate the pull station. And this is something that inspectors sometimes do just to save time, I guess. I'd rather pull it personally, but some people like key activating it. So basically you stick the key in, you open it, and since there's a button on the inside, it will automatically activate. Here we go. Area for your group. 
All right, the system's back in normal condition, and since we've set off a lot of alarms in this test, for fun, we might as well play the all clear message. Go ahead and do that here. May I have your attention, please? The building emergency has ended, and all clear has been given. Please resume normal activities. All right, that's gonna do it for today's system test. Thank you for watching, rate, comment, and subscribe, and have a good day, everyone.